hey guys welcome back to my channel or welcome to if you're new it's a new day it's a new vlog spends the weekend with her dad and then sunday is the day i come pick her up i still had a lot of stuff to do that i didn't get done over the weekend so i left a little bit early to get that done right now i'm on the way to ross because i want to return this perfume that i bought i went and i brought this at ross the other day i looked up the scents on like google or whatever and it said it was like a good scent it was really recommended like flowers and stuff which is normally like my usual scent i'm not like a sweets girly i don't want to smell like brown sugar and cupcakes i like i really like the home scents clean linen and stuff like that but floral is also a-okay in my book but this one i don't know i think i was just trying to be bougie and i saw the packaging saying burberry and i was like you know it don't smell that good y'all mm, stink it's going right back so we're here in this ross parking lot i'm about to go inside right now and exchange this i should have stuck with my usual mark jacobs but your girl wanted to switch it up and be different and you know like i said i wanted to upgrade my per my perfume collection that didn't work out so we're gonna see if they still got that mark jacobs perfume in here I returned to Marc Jacobs perfume. They ended up giving me store credit instead of my moolah bag. She was actually kind of rude. She was acting like she didn't want to do nothing, none of her jobs. She didn't even want to give me the refund to begin with. Yeah, I went over there to go exchange that perfume for the Marc Jacobs that I saw last time. But it's not even there no more, y'all. Somebody bought it. I really should have bought it then because it was only $39.99 and it was that big bottle yeah your girl missed out right now i'm in the baby section i always end up here i can never go to a store without checking it out and they actually got some pretty nice stuff you guys look they got this cute little toy for 10.99 she really don't need no more toys it is so cute y'all she loves wheels or anything that's like round she always goes like this or like rolling her hand but for 10.99 i'm not sure if this was that price they also had this little fan thing this one is what 7.99 but this is also one of those things that only stick to certain surfaces. We had something like that and it don't stick to a lot of the stuff at the house. Oh, that one for boys. I did want one of these though. Oh, this is pretty cool for like the smaller babies. $19.99. They got some seats, $34.99. Ooh, future basketball player. How much is this? $8.99? I don't know if she's gonna have to know how to use this yet, y'all, but I really like this. Right, you guys i'm now in the shoe section i've been looking for sani some more like soft bottom shoes but these are the only ones that they have and i'm not really too sure about this color because i don't feel like it would go with a lot of her outfits but look y'all all the other girls shoes these are like way too big where do y'all shop for y'all kids shoes comment down below let me know because i don't know where it's to go these would be her size but these are like so ugly and basic who wants these all right, y'all, so I'm leaving out of Ross and I'm leaving empty-handed. All of that I showed you and I ended up getting nada, zilch, okay? I low-key want to try a different Ross, but I'm not too sure if I have enough time for that today. I got to head home and I got to clean up a little bit, of course, before Sonny gets here. And I also got to finish editing my come to work with me working a nine to five 
while being a single mom part two video i know you guys are super excited for that one y'all love the first one it should be out before this video so if you haven't already seen it it'll be in the eye above make sure to go check it out so that's really why i'm kind of in a rush to get home so maybe ross shopping will continue later on in the vlog all right guys as you can see i am back home now i'm currently in my backyard i have all of tink's play pens and toys and everything out here because don't judge me y'all my mama recently asked me like two days ago have you been disinfecting tink's toys y'all i don't know why i never thought about cleaning her actual toys like i've always cleaned her bouncer and her little eating area because she always gets that dirty but her toys i never thought about cleaning which makes sense because she has these in her mouth 24 7 so i have all of her hard toys nothing with fabric or electronics in here full of hot water i'm gonna add some dawn this soap because this is strong baby it helped the duckies then we got some disinfectant spray. Spray everything real, real good. And we're gonna let this soak while I spray down her eating chair and her bouncer. I'm about to drop off some of Sonny's old baby clothes. Just some of the ones that Once Upon a Child didn't take. Um, these are, I believe, zero to three. Sonny still fits 
some zero to three so like i said it wasn't like a full clean out when i did that video i have a lot of you guys always asking me about giving away all of sonny's old things to you guys and um most of the time i either take them to once about a child to get a little moolah because your girl be needing money or i donate them to my friends because a lot of my friends had babies around the time that i had a baby it's just easier for me to drop it off to somebody that's in my city rather than shipping it off because some of you guys that are hitting me up are outside of the u.s you guys and i do have a sister that lives in germany and my mom ships to her sometimes not all the time because y'all that shipping be like ninety dollars that's not even counting the amount you spend on whatever's in the package that's just the shipping so i don't know if y'all think i'm a millionaire but we can't be paying ninety dollars just to ship out some stuff i'm so so sorry y'all but if y'all stick around i do plan on doing a giveaway i'm not too sure if i want to do two winners one having a boy and one having a girl but i do know y'all i want to do a giveaway to my subscribers i'm not going to announce when it's dropping i'm not going to announce what video y'all just gonna have to watch the vlogs and it's gonna be somewhere in the middle of a vlog but i have a lot of expecting mothers on my channel and i want to do a newborn baby starter kit so i want to go buy like some bottles some pacifiers a blanket all that type of stuff maybe a little stuffy and put it all in a diaper bag and ship it off to one lucky loyal subscriber yes of course you're gonna have to be subscribed yes you're gonna have to follow me on all my social medias but we'll come up with the rules when we get there so y'all stay tuned for that if y'all been asking y'all got a baby coming up hit that subscribe turn on the post notification bells because you don't want to miss it Go ahead, Charlie. It's now T minus 20 minutes till I gotta go hit the road to get my baby Sunny. So I'm gonna start making her bottles before I go. So I'll have some bottles for tonight and some bottles for tomorrow morning. Her toys are also now done drying. So I'm gonna take them all out and put them in their place. I'm making a change today. The lid have been taking the pain away. I heard you was giving your chain away. That's kind of like giving your fame away. What's wrong with you? I sit in a box where the owners do. A boss is a road that I've grown into. I love you to death, but I told you the truth. I can't just be with you and only you. Yeah. I got one virtual, got one in that day. It's the only two. Man, how many times have I shown it through? Man, how many nights I've been woke? Swerving the pot holes. Not trying to fuck up the wheels on the road, okay? Funny how life goes. He thought he was free, now we wiping his nose, okay? As soon as you give him your soul, you blow up and they say you're selling your soul, okay? They want my life exposed. They want to know about the highs and lows. Well, summer, all I did was rest, okay? And New Year's, all I did was stretch, okay? And Valentine's Day, I had sex, okay? We'll see what's about to happen next, okay? Okay, okay, we'll see what's about to happen next. Okay, 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 we'll see what's about to happen. Y'all look who bless you. What's going on with ya? You got some sniffles. Look who here, y'all. Look at that skin, baby. You can't even see all of that. You only see her shoulder. She tired, y'all. It's so pretty in the back. Look at that hair. Same time. Talking all day, that's what she do. Mm -hmm. You want to say hi? Now you don't want to talk? Say hi. Ow. See if you do it. Go. So, she said, I was just with you all weekend. It's mommy time. Oh, you want to go? Yeah. Go. Hmm. Sunny. She's looking at the camera. You ready to go home, stick a butt? You want to go home? Little YouTube, y'all. <laughs> Bad news. We not going home. Something wrong with my car. I don't know what the fuck wrong with my car, but something wrong with it. It ain't trying to start. Okay. Dang. <laughs> Alright y'all, so as y'all can see the car is running. Me and Tink are on the way home. Thank God for me, Madre. He brought me a what's it called? 
a little jumper box, a jumper power box for your car a long time ago. And we used to have to use it on Rico's car all the time and I've never used it on my car before because I've never had car problems for real. And that came in clutch, y'all, because he, he had just took his jumper cables out of his car. So if I wouldn't have had that in my car, I don't know what would have been done. He told me to take it to O'Reilly's tomorrow or I guess just take it anywhere to get my battery checked to see if my battery needs to be charged or if my battery's good, check my alternator because my alternator could be draining my battery. I don't know what none of that means, y'all. All I know is the battery. I don't even know how to take the battery out. So, because I know I can do it at Walmart, but I don't even know how to take it out of my car. So, I just go ahead and go to the people. He said it should be free. So, then people try to play me. They know something straight shot no stopping just in case my car don't want to run again because i just don't know how to use it so shout out to the baby daddies for helping me i'm gonna see you guys when i see you guys say hey tank say hey pretty mamas Hey guys, so it is currently the next day. It's September 18th at 12.25. Change of scenery, your girl over here in the passenger seat, passenger princess. Me and my mom and of course Tink are headed over to the mall right now because I wanted to go to the Ross over on that side of town. The Ross over here it didn't have nothing. I have a couple of things that I wanna see about getting, but like if I don't get it, it's cool. I wanna find more shoes for Tink because all she really has right now is sandals and those stay sliding off her feet. So I'm thinking if she has something with like Velcro on it, it'll stay on better. Another perfume, maybe the Marc Jacobs perfume, since that is what I was going for originally. Some perfume and I just didn't like that one. Like I said, I took that Burberry perfume back and they gave me this here gift receipt. So I'm gonna see maybe if I can exchange it for another perfume. And I also wanna get just some lotion. Just because that lotion there is cheap, like $4.99, something like that, just some not smell good lotion because I have enough of that. I want some actual moisturizing lotion. And maybe like, I will look for some mascara because I need some mascara. But like I said, this is just stuff that I just looking for. It's not nothing that I necessarily need, but it's the money on the car and I gotta spend it at Ross, so why not? But she knocked out, look at her. Her head all crooked. My baby, I ain't put her in there like that, she did that. She was not looking like this when I put her in there. Oh, and update on my car. So, just morning, we ended up going to Auto Parts, something Auto Parts. And um, we got my car tested and stuff like that. Turns out nothing's wrong, I guess. Um, I just ran my battery, I guess, not turning off a light or not closing the door all the way or something like that. But when I drove, it ended up charging my battery up on its own. So nothing was good there. But I also did go to Discount Tire for them to put some air in my tire because my tire light has been on for the longest. And when I first went there, they said my tires were straight. But my tire light been on for about like two weeks now, and so they had to put air in all of my tires. They said it was supposed to be at like an 86, and it was at like an 82. So I don't really know what that means, but they filled it back up to where it's supposed to be, so hopefully this car is running A-OK -okay smooth. But yeah, I'm gonna see you guys when we get to the mall. Okay, so they got a lot of mascaras in here to look like, but I'm not too sure what would be the best choice. I think I want one with like a curved brush. I had this one before. This one looks a little curved. Green edition? I don't know. Feel like I'm living on my own path. 
On a spaceship, now I'm a space cadet. Big white mansion in my habitat. Ain't a lot of stitch like a laser tag. Fuck a rich bitch, have a rich set. Smoke a lot of trees, need a weed plant. All right, you guys, so so far I found a, a body lotion. I've never heard of this brand before. Lucetta, but it is shea butter and argan oil. Smells amazing. And then I did a little bit of research on this last fall fold mascara. And it seems like it's the best choice. And this is in like a little, what's it called? A little security box. So I feel like, you know, when they lock stuff up, it gotta be a good product. It's only $4.99. This lotion is $6.99. They didn't have any good perfume, so we're gonna head to the baby section. And you stingy, my bro, gonna get a payroll. I just want the pretty women in the pay so I can only hit the engine in this lambo. On a spaceship, now I'm a space cadet. Big white mansion in my habitat. Y'all, this is so cute. Thankful, grateful, blessed. And you got the little pumpkin one on the back. Then you got this little leaf falling one. That one ain't too cute, but. It's a three piece set, it's only $7.99. Six months. Ah! Now, why you did that? Smoke a lot of trees, need a weed plant. I did take a lean where the lean at. Sleeping on these G's is a bean bag. I've been going jeans cause I'm cool, right? New cool, I was basically. Oh, look at y'all matching with y'all green. She got two different color greens. Okay, you ready to go? She ain't want to be up in Ross. Look, brought the car seat just to use it for storage because somebody don't want to be in it. <laughs> <laughs> Pushing it as a cart, basically. Oh, look, this is already so cute. I like this. That's a boy. This cute girl can wear it too. This ain't little cutie with the little sweater. What is, what is it, a dress? Yep. That's cute. Look, and you get the They look big too. Yeah. Look, they look like real shoes. I told about a wet time. All right, y'all. So we are headed out of the mall right now. Well, kind of out of the mall because we're about to go to a restaurant that's kind of in the same circle. But I just want to give you guys a quick haul. Everything that I got out of. Ross. I went in there saying that I needed some more hygiene products as far as like perfumes and body lotions So I didn't find any perfumes, but I did find this body lotion I haven't tried this brand before but it smells super good So I decided to give it a try and plus it's a big bottle for only being $6.99 I needed some more claw clips because all of mine broke so I picked up this cute set for $5.99 Plastic see-through ones and then last but not least I picked up this mascara by the brand laura cl carter's for baby sunny food now, mommy already opened one of them because y'all can tell she's not a youtuber y'all she love buckets but this one is basically for the bath it has holes at the bottom so water comes through this bib that says my first halloween because that's what we were going in there for originally looking for a halloween outfit got this clips right here for her hair it just goes to the week monday tuesday and so on and so forth super cute and they come in like different metally colors so we got this set of bows it isn't really colors it's more of patterns so we got the jean and then we got the lace so this would be super cute to style with a lot of her outfit so right now we made it to this mexican restaurant called rio bravo we haven't tried this mexican restaurant yet so it's gonna be a first time for everybody they already inside my mom and tink they left me so let me hurry up and get in here and see how it goes. I hope it's good. I hate wasting money on food. What's the matter, T? Thank you. So they just brought our chips and salsa.
Okay, let's see what they got. Straight to my toes, cause this is my favorite section. steak, some chicken, some shrimp, sour cream, and then this is mine. And yeah, what mommy got some fajita stuff. Look at sign. It's currently 8.15 and Tink is still sleeping. I'm finna warm up this leftover Mexican food from that restaurant we tried earlier. Y'all, 10 out of 10, highly recommend. What was it? It was called Arroz de Bravo. I know Arroz is rice. I don't know what the Bravo part is, but that's basically like, the name of the restaurant is Rio, Rio de Bravo or something like that. So I don't know what that word I mean, but it's rice and something and it's rice and good before i do that though i do have to do these dishes i'm finna get these dishes done because they been piled up and i still gotta put away these toys because i know i said i was gonna do it earlier but i never did so Go by busting. All right, come on. Good morning. We're currently headed to Tink's six month appointment. So, y'all know what that means. She's gonna be getting a couple of shots. My whole Tink a wing. So, her appointment is scheduled for 10 o'clock. It is currently like 9 40, 9 35. 
somewhere in that time range so we doing good on time so i ended up giving her like two milliliters of tylenol because last time when she got her four months appointment if you guys haven't already seen that vlog it'll be linked in the eye above so go check it out but the tylenol really did help she wasn't as she was fussy of course during the shots but afterwards she really just slept kind of the whole day so I'm hoping that's what she does today, Loki. I felt a little bad last time because I was like, my poor baby, like, what did they give you? But like, I gotta get this wig promo done. As y'all see, the braids is back in my hair, but it's still not glued down, y'all. Not glued down. So we got a hat on today, rocking the hat again. She been turned six months, if you guys didn't know, she turned six months on the 9th of September. But her appointment was scheduled for the, what, what is today, the 18th? What's she doing? She been really kind of fussy all day. She slept all night, you guys. She literally did not wake up for a bottle, not once. Normally, she wakes up around, like, 4 or something for a bottle, which she did wake up. But, like, I just put the passion back in her mouth, and she went right back to sleep. So, she ended up getting up at 7. And I think she went to sleep early yesterday, too. She went to sleep at, like, 6-something, 7. So, I don't know what it was about yesterday, but... That was a good sleep, y'all. Look, y'all. She back there looking sleepy. I don't know what she's so sleepy for. Try that? No, I wasn't trying to give her the pre made ones, I was trying to make my own she stuff. Make but... your own. She is mm -hmm. so good. <laughs> she has a lucky, she's lucky to have a mom like you, then, huh? Yeah, thank I you. I mean, I, I've always bought baby food for my kids. Mm -hmm. I didn't have a chance, I don't have time to do it. Or you can make your own soup, like have the veggies and hamburger meat, and then mm -hmm. you blend in the blender and give it to her. Okay. You can do that. I was about to say, chicken. I don't know if she's supposed to be like, because sometimes I'll be scared to give her like big chunks. I'll be wanting it to be blended. I don't know. If yeah, she's yeah, yeah. I mean, you will, but as she gets older, you're going to get thicker and thicker with the food. Mm -hmm. So she gets used to it. Okay, so it's still blending. Still blending. You blend right it now. because even if you buy it, it's the same thing. It's blended. Yeah. It's not going to be chunky. She ain't like of it at all. You. <laughs> okay, well, it's not going to hurt mm -hmm. or anything. <laughs> Yeah, she just, I think she just knows somebody's table. Okay, then sit up, sit up. Okay, hold up a sec. Hold up a sec, then. I don't want to cry. I want to listen to her. Hey. She's too smart. That's what it does. Yeah, that's what the lady said. She said, oh, she know this table. She already know. Open the door. Thank you. Okay, that looks fine. Okay. All right, let's get that back. I'm sorry. What's the matter? It tastes good, don't it? Love it. I know that's all. No. That's mm. it. Thank you, pretty girl. She ain't gonna want. She gonna spit it. Out, <laughs> it's okay. 
thing. Hey, you want to hold mama's hand? I don't know, baby. I'm sorry. I oh, know. One, two, three. Oh, baby. One, two, three. Oh, you gotta get your little band aids. Hold on. Oh, you don't have to scream that hard. Oh, you got like your bear suit. Just put your shirt on and we can get out of here, okay? Oh, no. baby daddy and tell him I want him back. Cause why am I out here pumping my own gas? This is ghetto. So we just made it back to the house. Tink just got her six month appointment shots. She got two needle shots and one oral as always. Right now she back to knocked out. As y'all can see, my baby had a long day. She was screaming like, I'm pretty sure y'all can hear it in the video. Y'all hear me say like, she ain't never screamed this loud. I feel so bad for her. But to be honest, she was really like crying the whole appointment, even if she wasn't getting shots like us just sitting in the doctor's office. She was just like being real fussy and antsy. Um, I had a bottle for her, a six ounce bottle, and I brought rice to put in it. And I was trying to save it for after the shots, but I ended up giving it to her like a little bit before and then the rest after. Which seems like that always happens. They said that she just is a smart baby and she just already know what's about to happen. Yeah, so I really don't know how the rest of the day is going to go. So if the video ends here, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on my social medias. They'll be on the screen and in the description box. Tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend that Aaliyah uploaded a new video. Yeah, we about to head inside. I'm about to put her down and see if she stays asleep. And if not, then we'll get into some more activities for this vlog. If so, I'll see you guys on the flip.